Hey guys, my name is Mariah. And I'm Pastor Sai. And we are excited this week for Kids for Truth. Now, we also have some other things going on. This week we're going to be starting our Fighting Fair course, uh, and it's a marriage uh, class, uh, just to help us strengthen our relationships uh, with our spouse, and then also uh, with Christ, as we better learn how Christ loved us, how we can love others. The other thing we're also starting this week is a course uh, on evangelism, and so learning how we can better share the gospel uh, with people, questioning uh, what is evangelism. And so parents, part of the reason why we have Kids for Truth is so you have the opportunity to take some of this time as well, and we hope that you'll join us for one of those two classes. Now, Pastor Sai, I looked ahead in our lesson, and one of the things I'm super excited about this week is all the meteors that we get to learn about in the lesson. Meteors. Yeah, I, like the I don't stars remember. and the meteors and stuff uh, like that. Meteor, it said meteors. the meteor of our sins. Meteor. Oh, Mr. Curls. What? It's, we're talk, this week we're talking about Jesus being our mediator. A, medi a mediator is like a go-between. So it's like if you, you you have siblings, right? Yeah. So if you ever fight with your siblings, never. Ne never fight with your siblings. Well, oh, are you lying? We we just talked about the Ten Commandments. Just but, a little. Yeah, that's what I thought. A mediator is actually somebody who's a go-between. So whenever you and your siblings fought, your parents probably got in between and tried to resolve the issue. Well, that's what Jesus is for us with God because of our sin. And the memory verse for this week, 1 Timothy 2, 5 through 6, talks about his position as a mediator between us and God and how he prayed the ransom or price for our sin. That sounds really neat. And you know, after talking about it last week, maybe I am going to have to go get one of those $10 dictionaries you talked about. You probably should. Yeah. We're excited to see you guys this week at Kids for Truth. Tomorrow night, 645, Wednesday night at 6.45. Yeah, Wednesday night, 6.45. We'll see you guys there. Bye.